Interim Superintendent of Schools, Dr. Winnie Hamilton, presented Stanford's 2012-2013 Public Schools Budget to the Press and Board of Education January 17th. The budget is just over $237 million, a 3.49% increase from last year's budget. The proposed increase is the second lowest requested increase in the last 10 years. The budget includes five new initiatives that total roughly $450,000. The budget adds three world language teachers to support a new world language program in Stanford Elementary Schools. What language and in what grade the program will begin is not yet decided. Research would support the sooner you start children experiencing another language, learning another language, they actually can become fluent and think in that language. Also included is a district-wide health teacher for elementary and middle school students. Stanford does not yet have a state-required health curriculum outside of high school. This was a concern that there are children that are going through our system and not until high school are they getting any formal curriculum. Hamilton's budget calls for a summer school program for students entering kindergarten and first grade. The hope is using grant money that we have to do this is going to allow students from pre-K to um, and then kindergarten to have actually two years <clears throat> extra opportunity before they enter first grade. Also included is a student support position at Rogers International School and summer planning that would allow Stanford to service more special education students in district. Hamilton says the budget also factors in $2.48 million that will be saved by more efficient uses of energy, supplies, transportation, and more. For final approval, the budget has to pass through the Board of Education and Mayor Michael Pavia in February, the Board of Finance in March and April, and the Board of Representatives in May.